All right, I think we found our camp spot, a little dispersed place to call home for the evening. Blessed in the Pacific Northwest, gotta do a quick water run so that I can cook some food and rehydrate for the night. Right down this epic little trail. Look at this. Wait, I gotta climb this again? Look at this insane water spot. How good is this? I got a new water filter, it's a bee free. I'm really curious to see how this works. This thing is so much faster than the Sawyer that I've been using. And it comes with a silicone bag, which I think is a little better than the Sawyer plastic bag. Seems a little more sturdy. I'm just saying, if you're interested, I put a link below. If you're not, then the link is above. <laughs> and then the pro move, once the three bottles are filled up, is to fill up the bladder, and then you get an extra bottle's worth. I'm just saying. Hey, Bobby Bottlesworth here. That's what I always say. Look at Ron's adorable slumber hole. <laughs> okay, back at camp, got water up here. Look at this epic view. I can't even believe we get to spend the night here. I'm soaking wet from riding in the rain all day, so I'm gonna change and we'll be right back after these messages. All right, I've got my slightly more civilized clothing on, and this is what I decided to do for camp shoes on this trip. They're called Zero. They're like some minimalist, feel the earth kind of a thing, which, whatever. But look at how fucking small they are. They're flat as hell. Ron went with the Berkey Omies, which are one of my personal favorite traveling shoes. The difference between the two is the Burks are twice as bulky, but they weigh half as much. And these are half as bulky, but weigh twice as much. So, pick your poison. Hey, I put a link to those. Guess where I put that, right? Take a guess. Thick, dry, warm socks with my minimalist, feel the earth kind of mom or jammers. I kind of like it. I think my dad would be proud. Oh, look at Ron's cool pump thing. The big Agnes Air Core. Oh my god, that is... How efficient is this? Just gonna roll with it. Roll it, roll it. Okay, check it out. One more camp move that I had to do. One was so that I could take you along on this adventure. I ended up getting this, what is this? A Goal Zero Sherpa 100. It's basically a portable power supply, which is how I can charge my hammerhead because this thing doesn't last much more than one day. And batteries so that I can take you along. Plus this thing is cool. See that little black circle on the top? That thing? That is so you can put your iPhone on it and it'll charge it wirelessly. How fucking cool is that? Ron, you want to charge your phone? See if it works. <sighs> Dude, how fucking cool is that? Hey, that's really cool. Check out Ron's pro move to take the insoles out of your wet shoes so that they dry overnight. That is, that's a super smart move. What are you working with here? Triple Mac. Two servings, how many calories? 800 and fucking 60. Oh my God, you're gonna put my outdoor herbivore switchback stuffer at a shameful comparison of one serving at 400 calories. What you gonna do? I'm gonna be nutrient deficient tonight. The weather keeps changing. Every other minute, it's something different. What is two cups? I don't fucking know it. Can it's I like one cup, but then you double it. Oh, gotcha. Okay, two cups. Okay. Ooh, it smells. Okay. I'm about to throw these sardines in my outdoor herbivore to just conflict the whole thing. Hey, the sunlight's dying, so we're gonna say goodnight, goodbye. We'll see you in the morning. Uh, enjoy your dry, comfortable, warm bed tonight. We will be enjoying the opposite of that. And we'll see you in the morning. So, you know. It's stuck on my head. <laughs> this is just my look now. I like that trendsetter. Yep. If there's anything you liked here, go ahead, hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed, now might be the time. And check out the EBD Gear Shop, the greatest place on the internet. Stay tuned for more bikepacking adventures. Until then, this is Dustin Klein.